morning guys, I'm Josh Bushwhacker and today I'm going to be doing something different and something that I haven't done in a long time. I'm pulling my canoe out, I haven't had it out in a few years now, I've kept it down here at Point Clare and I'm going to suss out a bit of Narara Creek and just around the waterway here, just in the areas where the boats can't get. So watch today and we'll see what we can bring out of the water. in a couple of years but you know it's not to say it's not going to do us any good fishing it's going to require a bit of effort to get those floodies but when you when you get them it's all worth it that's a lovely little flathead you got there it's at least early 30s too look at that it's beautiful it's a good little flatty man how does that feel mate You're on there, mate, little one. Bring him up. Oh, no, that's, that's half the work done. What you got here, another little lizard? Oh, beautiful, mates. Beautiful, look at that. Look at that. That is a nice flathead. About the same size as one you got before. Here. What have we got here, Trent Saddam? Hey! Come here, buddy. Oh, mate, you won't believe it. Look at the size of this little platy. Whee! It's got to land him. It's got to land him. This is the fun part. Got him big time. Whee! <laughs> He's easily a 40. Look at that, Benny. Argue with that fish. In the water. So we've got a few floaties in the canoe so far this morning. The tide wasn't really in our favour getting out as it's just too low, so we had to do a bit of semi-portage. If you know what a portage is, it's sort of picking up your canoe and moving it along dry land. But we had to pick it up and move it along shallow water. So the tide's turned, it's working in our favour now and we're making our way back slowly still. Alright, that was a little bit of fun. Potentially the last flat that I'll catch of 2019 as well. So, if you've got a canoe, kayak, and you're thinking about some spots or want to know some spots to go to, try look for the really shallow areas where there's a lot of weed because you can go to the places where normally no one fishes. And as you've just seen, the results are always good. So I'm going to see you next time. If you can, give us a like, give us a subscribe, and uh, Happy New Year's 2020.